the main things that impacted me most here at UB was how I was pushed out of my comfort zone, how I was challenged. I felt that academically, I was very, very much challenged. As a teaching assistant, that was the, the way I was able to fund coming to UB. Had I not received a teaching assistantship, I probably would not have attended UB and, and perhaps not even received a master's degree. When I graduated from UB in 1980, the market was booming for anybody that had a technical degree. And so I had about 10 job offers. I had decided to work for Shell because it was a European-based international oil company. I have always had a passion for worker safety and protection of the environment. The other thing was the incredible opportunity to work in different countries with different people. My last team was made up of Malaysians, Indians, Dutch, British, and Americans. I learned a lot at UB back in the day because this, even back when I went here, there was a, a really diverse student body. Carrying that diversity mindset that I learned here at UB into the workforce was just so rewarding. As a member of the School of Engineering Dean's Advisory Council, I get to come back to campus uh, several times a year. And it's been such a joy. I've been able to give seminars to the students. And I enjoy that as much today as I did 40 years ago when I was a teaching assistant. You know, I remember, and I even looked at my degree, and on the uh, UB emblem, it says to learn, to search, and to serve. I think now I'm in the serving, and it's all about giving back to a university and to a place that gave me so much opportunity in my life.